Hey guys, so I want to do a spot of gaming here on some uh, nice new phones that we do have in the mid uh, range category. So we do have the Nokia 6, which is a very nice silver uh, device here. Uh, we have the Sony Xperia XA1, which obviously we haven't forgotten about. Very gold, uh, bezel-less kind of display here. Uh, we have the Redmi Note 4X, which comes with a Snapdragon processor this time, uh, compared to the MediaTek they did have. Very nice little handset with a colour uh, from the heavens here. And we do have the A5 as well, 2017, because we will do one to see a comparison of these newer devices against the A5, which uh, is arguably still very relevant in terms of you know uh, the spec here. So we're going to have a look at GTA and see how they do compare. And we're just going to start all these up at the same time. I'm going to just show you as well, uh, we are running the uh, Max visuals here so you can see how the graphics does compare on all of them. So we do have quite a few different configurations here in terms of the uh, you know, uh, spec, so do bear that in mind. And I think the brightness is on all of them on Max. So let's go to the start. I will also turn the speaker up on all of them uh, when we get into it, so it's fair, and let's go, 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 go. So Nokia 6 is a bit slow here, starting off. So we're going to start off with Nokia 6 here, as you can see. So we want to just mute every other one because we want to hear the speakers here on Nokia 6. So if you like your game in slow motion, this could be pretty epic. <laughs> yeah, so you can see Nokia really cheap talent. I always think he's talking to me. You see Nokia really cheap talent when it came to the processor here. And that is quite annoying. So we're going to go to medium. Oh. Well, that was good, wasn't it? Let's try again. Hey, hey, hey. So there he is. Ah. <laughs> I can still see light on the medium here, which is not good. We got you a nice little place to stay. Stop lying. Maybe. Oh, this is just as bad. So you can see, this process is not up to par, really. A little bit better than before. I'd say it's playable, but still, you know, not a gaming device. Uh, let's just go right to the bottom here. Down here. This is better. The goddamn car? Very playable on the lowest setting. Uh, but generally, not a gaming device, you know. It sounds a little bit tinny, it's on the side here, but it's not too bad. Uh, so let's just compare with some other phones here. We do have the XA1 from Sony, uh, which uh, comes with MediaTek. And this looks 
way better. My driving doesn't. The screen looks better. But look at that. That is amazing gaming. Wow, I'm impressed. I think the speaker sounds better as well. Wow. So let's just go down to the medium here, see how good it can get. So we can just uh, see on the back here. So yeah, you can see very good performance from XA1. Indeed. Very surprised about that. But yeah, nice indeed. Uh, we're going to now the Redmi, the Miku edition, uh, so we can see how this is. I can't believe how variable this is. This is really variable. So we're going to medium now, straight away. Still a bit disappointing, you can't put it on the max like the XA1. And finally, we do have an Exynos representative here. This is the uh, A5 2017. And we just uh, turn it up here. I think this is going to be the best. And you can see straight away, very nice performance. Great uh, screen here. The uh, so I don't really need to do too much here. You can see absolutely fantastic on the A5. Probably the best, or just drawn with XA1. Uh, so terrible gaming when it comes to the Nokia 6, unfortunately. Uh, maybe they should have gone with a better processor overall. You know, that uh, I think is the lesson here, really. Uh, so, yeah, hope uh, you find it helpful, though, if you're looking at these devices. And we'll certainly check out some other uh, stuff as well, like uh, maybe the battery life. Uh, so, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.